So greetings, it's Mike from LiveMyAssOff.com. I'm gonna sit here, and with any luck, I won't get attacked by these, by these sprinklers. But I'm here at work, um, which is basically that building right there, University of San Diego, and um, it's a Friday in May, and I just thought I'd check in. Basically, the students are uh, leaving uh, shortly, uh, and uh, I think they're pretty much done finals this week, and then they head off to back to their homes later in the week, uh, or, uh, you know, sometime this weekend or next week, in fact. Uh, it depends on, you know, finals and projects and that sort of thing. So, anyway, but I just thought I'd check in because it's an interesting time, and of course it happens every year, um, and it happened to me uh, back in 2010 when I graduated uh, with my master's, and, uh, you know, it's a change, right? So you've been doing sort of the same thing, and for my master's it was basically for two years. For most of these students it's four years. Uh, four years here, uh, certainly four years in summary, because a lot of the transfer in. But it's an interesting time. Uh, it's also an interesting time for me, uh, and uh, a milestone, if you will, this year, uh, because I'll be um, I'll be 25 years sober, which is it feels really good. I got to tell you. And uh, so you know, I just thought I'd check in because I mean, it's an interesting sort of um, thing that happens every summer. Uh, in, you know, certainly in the United States, uh, where this time of year, uh, school ends and summer begins uh, for most kids, for most students, for, for most uh, uh, graduates. And uh, so it makes me think, like, you know, what am I going to do? Like, what am I going to do to change? We have a lot of these, uh, one of the sort of uh, tenets or one of the um, mantras that we have here at USD right now is leading change. Uh, and so that's been a big deal for, uh, for the culture here at USD. Um, and it is sort of one of the president's uh, charges for us. It's like, how are we leading change? That's uh, San Diego Bay in the background, by the way, over there. And you can pro there's no way, but that's SeaWorld. <laughs> Pretty far away. Um, but nonetheless, from your dorm room up there, that's the view you get as a freshman. So not too bad, right? Um, but anyway, yeah, so it always makes me think, like, you know, what am I doing uh, to better myself uh, and to better the world around me around this time of year? Because as the students leave, one of the things I always say to them when I get the chance to uh, facilitate a, one of the leadership, undergraduate leadership classes that I'm a part of is, uh, you know, I honestly uh, hope that I can get to work for you someday. And, of course, they look at me like, wait, old guy, work for us? <laughs> um, there's that. But then the other thing is, is that, you know, you guys are young and naive enough to think you're going to change the world, which means you will. So get busy and cure cancer. <laughs> um, and, I, and I know that some of them will. Uh, I know that some of them will start businesses that will change people's lives for the better. Uh, and I'm really looking forward to being part of that. So anyway, so I just wanted to check in and, and kind of say, hey, you know what? I hope uh, wherever you're watching this, um, it may give you time to pause and say to yourself, okay, so what am I going to do today starting this morning? in the morning as the sun rises. What am I going to do this morning that will add a positive impact on my life, positive impact on those around me, those that I love, uh, and those that I potentially dislike? <laughs> but, uh, you know, how am I going to add value to the world? Because it's interesting when I hear people say, and I've said it before too, oh, I don't get paid enough. And I would submit that you probably get reimbursed financially for the amount of value you bring somewhere. Um, and or you get reimbursed let's just say that so whether you add monetary value to your organization meaning that by participating in the in the company um, you know you generate like a million dollars in revenue and therefore they compensate you for let's say for the sake of argument one hundred thousand dollars so you know 10x your your energy right goes back to the goes back to the employee um, uh, or one tenth rather um, and so, but you know, the other way that I get compensated here is uh, the ability to build relationships, the ability to help other people, the ability to hug other people, quite frankly, at conferences and see my, my colleagues and my smart friends and that sort of thing that I sometimes only see once a year at these conferences that I go to. The ability to have time off to go see my parents uh, and spend with Gracie. So, you know, it's all, it's, it's all part of the package, all part of the benefits package, right? So anyway, I hope you're adding value today. If there's any way I can help you do that, just let me know. And it, I've always said, honestly, I really do hope you're living the dream. Because if you're not living the dream, you're doing it wrong. Ciao.